Welcome back to Isaac Champions, the mod that adds an A plus side. We've only done Isaac so far, but let's play my favorite character, the Lost. I don't have any idea what the Lost champion is going to be but here we go looks like we got an alges rune and a perthro a clear rune active item which allows me to use a pocket rune much like blank card uses a pocket card it does not look like i have holy mantle but instead i've got heartbreak which adds one broken heart every time i take damage once we reach a maximum of 12 broken hearts we will then die that seems worse than holy mantle i really like holy mantle this allows us to get hit multiple times in one room but up to a maximum of 12 and then looks like we have a, a an extra life of sorts so i should be able to fly into this room oh spicy key ah! okay we don't have an extra life it just hey it says broken heart times three in the top i've got fiend folio on these freaking cheaty ass red fires shooting through rocks Folio. I've got improved vanilla enemies. I've got repentance boss champions on. I've got a ton of mods. I'm gonna still try this. So I'm gonna see if I can weasel my my way out of this, even though I already have three broken hearts. Yeah, like this. This guy's new. Head bowler. Try me, sucker. Try me. You can't bowl over the gap, you idiot. You moron. We got some damage there that we gained. Uh, that, that might be heartbreak. The, the more broken hearts that we get, the more damage that we get. That's kind of cool. First item room. Rotten baby. There's nothing wrong with a good old rotten baby. Spawns flies. Flies do two times my damage. Would I be absolutely insane to say we could probably make do with the Perthro instead of the Alges? I'm feeling it. If I can win as Tainted Lost, I, I think that I can win as Champion Lost without an Alges. What's up with this room? No one's moving. Hello? Hmm. Why is everyone freezing in place? What is going on here? There's got to be a mod conflict, right? Oh, you're a son of a gun. Why is the turret head floating around? Did you see that? Nothing's making sense. Let's reset. Reset the whole thing. All right, we're back in. Let's just read the dang crown before we pick it up, huh? Removes Eternal D6. Removes Holy Mantle. Adds Heartbreak. Clear Rune. Rune Bag. Gives an Alge's Rune and a Perthrow. You die at 12 Broken Hearts. All right, there's nothing new there. Perthrow, you're coming with me. That had to just been a mod conflict. Sometimes when you install and uninstall mods and you don't restart your game, things get real wonky. Seemed like it was going to be a great run, but that doesn't mean we can't get another great run. What, what are you? Who are these flies? They go into the pot, they grab money out of the pot, and then fire the money at me. Adorable. Item room is King Worm. On use, grants the effects of a random worm trinket for the current room. That is awful. Goodbye. Fast bombs. Uh, starting off with bombs is strong, but I think we can do better here. Golems rock. Spawns a golem trinket on pickup. That's fiend folio for you. Hive mine. That could be really good for us. Oh, wow. These things attack real quick. Seagrams, what do you got? <laughs> Thanks. Clear on Perthro. Like, if we get an item in our secret room, it's going to be a happy day. Potentially. Probably. Maybe. Oh my god. We're fine. Dad's dip. Plus one max heart, plus one morbid heart. See, now that's not good for me. So I'll probably just per throw this. <sighs> yeah. Give me a planetarium, please. Take the fast bombs with that. We're going to find the secret room. Okay. Ooh. Copper bombs. 50% chance that they are a dud. Sticky nickel, you little. Crawl Space says Lazarus Rags. Was there a battery in our shop? I'm fine with taking it. I just, I don't want to play Lazarus right now. There was no battery. That's right. But there was a half off hive mind. Or a spin down when you need it. Nothing special there on that floor. We need something big here. Cellar 2, which is like a beehive. Dang you, Fiend Folio. I hate the bees. There's another alges here. Item room. <sighs> I think that I really like how defensive you can be as the loss by flying over rocks and Stompy ruins that. So 
Reroll. Uh oh. Don't like this. Lead him into the fires. Now this is pod racing. I also want a reroll for my devil deal. So this is probably be the last one before boss. It gave me baby crater. And it's possible. It's possible that we'll still have a reroll after the boss and devil. Power card, get that fool's gold for me, would you? And secret room, nice. And this gave me, yeah, super battery, more charges. All right, so do the math here. We can only pick one of these blue locks to unlock. I can't fly over the blocks. This is two full charges and a half. This would allow me to overcharge. Possibly the overcharge would be the best idea because then we could reroll twice in a deal with the devil. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Whoa, easy there, guy. Reroll time, go! Black hole. Yeah, I'm not going to be using active items here. Keeping my clear rune. Top secret room has got storage battery. Activate to store charge from your active item. Activate again to recharge. Do I get it and it's empty or do I get it and it's full? I think it gave me a couple charges. You're going to give me two nickels. One nickels. Good. Oh my goodness. This guy's got spectral shots. And what's that? Ah! Bro! Dude, Fiend Folio is so rigged. Hey, look at that though. I got a soul loath. Soul Aww. Reroll time! Ugh. Stop giving me active items! All right, double charge time. Boss, go! Pin's got nothing. At least Fiend Folio adds in where Pin is under the ground on this fight. That's nice. Health upgrade, yay. Deal with the devil, please give me something. Yeah, buddy! Woo! Yeah, dude, yeah, dude, yeah, dude. These are both really, really good. It's actually painful that I have to choose between the two of them. Every 40 seconds while in a hostile room, gain a shield for 10 seconds. Oh my God, empty vessel's delicious, but I gotta go with the twisted pair. Damn. All right, one reroll for you. Oh my god. Then one reroll for my thing. Item room. We got Twisted Pair chat. We can't complain. Things are good. What the hell is that? Rubber bullets. Luck effect a chance to fire a bullet tier that inflicts enemies with bruising. Bruised enemies take bonus damage from all sources of damage based on the number of stacks applied. Yep. Weird. Okay, our tiny little babies have a chance to fire bruising bullets, too. It's a baby with a gun! All right, all right, all right. <laughs> it's a good run. It's a good run. Now just give me a planetarium with Pluto. I'm very short on keys here. We had to skip our last uh, shop. There's some bruising for you. What this? I'm just kidding. It's good. We're fine. We're fine. That's got to be secret room. Having too much fun with these mods. What happened? What happened? Who hit me? What? Huh? <laughs> Got a clean bedroom. More crawl space for me. Three of diamonds. Three random coin pickups. All variants can spawn with equal chance. I'm a little bit afraid that they're gonna trap me in here. Ugh. Three of diamonds. Okay, we got a blessed penny, which gives me a wisp. A cursed penny, which could do a number of things. Minus one penny. We go for these pills. Bombs are key. Yeah, we've got our keys now. Health up. Just loving all the health-related things happening to me. What makes me small? That's my poor man's Pluto. Shot speed up. Shot sure. Speed up. I already have five broken hearts? Ow. Ooh. Would I? Could I? Should I? Probably yes. Got it. Jawbreaker, 10% chance to shoot teeth. Yeah. Queen of hearts, 1 to 20 red hearts. Just thank you for continuing to, to give me all the health that I asked for. Oh my, what is this? I've never seen such flies. Item room with chaos gave me some consolation prize. That's got to be fire rate, right? Shop with chaos. 
the hell? Errors crazy slots. On use a three number slot appears above your head. Using the item again locks in a number and the slot cycles faster after each number is locked. Once all three numbers are locked and the player is granted an item of the ID shown by the three numbers. If the item ID is invalid, then the player is teleported to the error room. I say we come back for that. If I'm teleported to my I am error room, that means I also lose out on my clear rune for the rest of the game. How do we guarantee that it's not invalid? Well, the first number that we choose just has to be like at least a five. No more than five. Trinket guy. Oh, hello. You have Sigil of Baphomet. Oh, oh, God, they're both really good for me. Sigil of Baphomet gives me short-term iframes upon enemy kill. Baby Spoonbender is going to give my Chad, no, not my Chad, my Twisted Pear homing. I'm going to maybe go Baby Spoonbender. Sigil of Baphomet is so good, but homing? That's just, it's offense versus defense. I chose offense. Go. Vishula didn't last long. Oh, whoop. hey, Nate. Oh. Almost ate those words. Cherry bomb. On use, the player picks up a small red bomb that deals no damage to the player and doesn't break rocks. No. Knockout drops. Hell yeah. We're shooting out fists and bullets. America. Let's say that we want to go for some spicy repentance-based items. We can go all the way up to 732. If we get birthright, though, useless items like HP upgrade, spectral tiers, or flight are removed from item pools. That sounds really good. C-section is 678. So 600 seems to be the best number for us. Here goes. So it, it, did, it, did it say left to right? Because if it goes right to left and it goes super fast on the last number and we get anything 730 plus... Uh, we're, we're done for. I, I, I honestly don't know what to do, you guys. Let's say that I wanted to go for Birthright, which is 619, and I hit the button on 9, thinking it's the right button, and it ends up on the left. We've now just I am aired myself. Go for the 9. It's, it's okay. It's 8. Okay, we locked in the wrong number. I'm just going to pretend that we didn't do that, and I'm leaving. Nope. Are we going to have this stupid number above my head for the rest of the freaking game? Oh my god. They said I didn't lose my clear rune. Another per throw. Interesting. Chop's got some damage. I'm probably just gonna take that. I could have re-rolled, but I mean I still can. Range. Oh, mom's knife? That would just pretty much guarantee the victory. If I get 15 cents by the end of the floor, I'll do it. If not, it's okay. Coat hanger. Yep. Boss fight. Braille. Knockback shots should do quite a number on uh, any of the pin-based enemies. <laughs> I just punched him out of his hole. Malice, would you stop giving me active items? Devil deal. Ugh. Hey, another Chad. Thanks, game. Fur throw now. I'm going to take damage and tears. We got one extra per throw, so let's rip this one for a Steven. Hmm. Mm hmm Haven't even been to the flipping item room yet in this floor. Boss trap room, no? Bloody gust. When receiving damage, just... Fur throw. Hollowed ground. Upon taking damage! I, I guess I technically can take damage as this champion lost. But, like, the whole point is that, like, I, I can't and shouldn't ever. Item room has got... Ugh, linger pain. Oh, this is exciting. Hey, glass spin down. Where were you when I found Laz rags? Eight keys. Let's do it. Okay, that was quick. Missing poster? I mean, that's not a bad idea, but I'm not getting rid of baby spoon bender. What's this card? Skip card. Clears the room of every grid, pickup, and enemy. Rooms cleared using skip card do not contribute to active item charges. Can be used against final bosses to skip phases, including the final phase. That's hilarious. Let's go see what these items are going to spin down to, since I'm out of per throw. That one will spin down to spare rib. What's a skeleton's favorite snack? Ribs! Stay! This one spins down to halitosis. It's just trash. Steven spins down to gish. Take my spare rib. This is pretty okay for me. I'm punching the bat off the screen and then he's spawning things in the room. What the hell? Oh, I hate this bat when he does the thing that he does. He didn't do the thing. Planetarium, we got it. And I got a per throw ready to go. Wait, we have chaos. Never mind. <laughs> oh, 
yep, life be like. Got the item? That's okay, I'll take it. Shops got candy heart. Mm. Tammy's head? Nah, I'm gonna reroll both of these. Fist full of ash, plus three bombs. Tinted rocks have otter visuals. Breaking tinted rocks spawns half a heart and grants a fading damage up. More tinted rocks. Breaking tinted rocks also has a 50% chance to remove a broken heart. Oh. Gain a broken heart each floor, though. Ooh. Ooh. Yep. Give me those tinted rocks. I don't even know what tinted rocks look like on this floor, I gotta be honest. They have otter visuals now, so I should be able to pick them out. Boss, what the? Junk strap? Who is this? Spikes, that does not hurt me. Not too bad. Oh! Sacred dice? That kind of alleviates the need to even have clear rune per throw. It's the sacred dice. All right. Item room, help me. Help me more. Chance to shoot backwards. I'm gonna take it. Hopefully we get rubber cement in the future. Shop reroll. Depths 2. Depths 2 is gonna be my floor, finally. Oh, I forgot to get broken hearts per floor. Dude, you need to hook me up with some tinted rocks now. Soul of Eve. If I took that into the boss trap room. Upon taking damage, no! I don't want your upon taking damage items, but I will take this. Get them, birds. Get them, birds! Shop has got greed. Holy moly. Eight broken hearts. We are, yep, that's, this is peak Isaac. Backstabber, I will just take that. Loving all these tinted rocks that we're getting on the floors to remove these broken hearts. It's a fun time. Pretty much having the time of my life right now. Mom, fight. Got her. Barely. Devil deal gonna give me bottle of water. Gulp's held trinket spawns a pill. Sounds worth it. One makes you smaller. Great. Nine broken hearts. Nine of them. Don't worry about me. I'll just go ahead and get these tinted rocks. Hey, there is one. Gimme, 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 gimme. Did not remove a broken heart. Judgment card. Yep, I got nothing to spend my money on, so here you go. Could blow them up, I guess, but it's chaos, right? So one guaranteed item, maybe better. Yep. Box of trinkets. Yeah, I'll take one. Yeah, I won't take that one. Tinted rock down there. You thought I was gonna miss you. Minus one broken heart and a damage upgrade. Oh, wow. Okay. Up to 10 broken hearts. Reroll. Mercurius. Most doors stay permanently open. Oh, well, we got our planetarium item. If we want to, we can just skip between rooms, I suppose. But, you know, I, I do want charges on my dice. This is a very interesting room. Two items to potentially re-roll here. A sad bomb is maybe is worth taking. Hey, these machines and you get a one-time use of those items. That was not good. Guess I killed that guy. There's a fun looking book. String missing. I think it emulates one random book. Sad bombs is cool, but we could do better. I have to go tinted rock. Still 10 broken hearts. None of this is gonna matter, you guys. We're gonna be freaking dead. Ah, oh, whoa, ew. Dead next floor. Another reroll. Go. 
Midas touch. Touching enemies. Yep, 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 yep. All good things for the lost. Holy crap, you guys. Seriously, the amount of times that we've gotten on damage items or something to do with our health. Looking at you. And then now this. Touching enemies. Come on. Lost versus super greed. Uh, where? I'll take that, though. Any good pills? Here's up. That's nice. Pretty fly. Love it. Save my reroll right now for Deal with the Devil, because I could have more than one item to reroll. Oh, gosh. I'm knocking them all around. Fine. It's fine. It's fine. No Deal with the Devil. I'll just take the shade. Reroll this into 69. Taking damage! This run is rigged. 100% rigged against me. 11 out of 12 broken hearts. Oh, good. Blood Oath. Drains Isaac's red hearts. Rigged. Reroll it. Bomb book. Gain a bomb. Gives bomb synergy for the rest of the floor. I, I, it's cool, but you guys, I need something better than this. Oh, minus one broken heart. Is this the comeback that we needed? Is this the comeback foreseen in the prophecy? What the hell? It lives. Let's go. New patterns. Oh, we're too strong. We were way too strong for you, Devil Deal. What do you got? Ooh, wow. That's... Mmm. Oh. I think I have to full clear here. I need to find the uh, Tinted Rocks. Otherwise, we die. This is horrible. I hate these guys. Oh, Tinted Rock. Please take away more of my stuff. Oh, Hagalaz. Perfect timing. That sounded like that worked. Down to nine broken hearts now. Lucky foot. Lucky foot. <laughs> Azerite spin down. Rerolls trinkets. No, but I'll reroll you. The relic. Plus one soul heart. Oh, boy. More stuff that is definitely good for the lost. Boink. Oh. Ooh. Fire rate down the drain, but damage way up. Back to 10 broken hearts now. I don't think there are even rocks on the last floor, so we better get some tinted rocks now. That is something I want, I think. Keeper's kin, it's good. Spawn spiders from rocks. Back down to nine. Do I just take the small rock? Yeah, probably. Planetarium disc. Oh, yikes. Angel disc. Okay, those are chaos. It's kind of cool, though. Look what we got. What's this thing? Massive amethyst. Shopkeepers in secret rooms are replaced by rune clusters. Blowing up rune clusters causes it to drop rune shards and runes. The tinted rock? Yes! Birds! Get him! It's a tough... Oh! Tough fight. Almost got me already. Oh, oh, he didn't get me. I'm up to 10. Back up to 10, Broken Hearts. 11 on the next floor. 11 out of 12, that means we'll be one hit. Instantly. That's not a good thing. Oh, hey, that's the rune shard thing. Soul of Cain. Let's pop that in some random location, I guess. See if we can find the ultra secret room. It's really just gonna give me more opportunities to die. Soul of Apollyon, I'll take that. Oh, hey, a library. Well, I could change from not being the lost. Nah, that wouldn't count as a victory. You can't stop me. Scatter bombs, that might kill me. All right, deal. I'll take five stupid scatter bombs. Well, I had an Alge's rune, but I lost it. Oh, hey, look, an Alge's rune. <laughs> give me a good chest. We need a good chest here. This can give me aggressive homing. Would I reroll everything? Would I D100 this entire run? Yeah, maybe. Robo Baby 2.0, portable slot. Let's give me that D100. Just give it to me. I got conjoined. What's that? Epic fetus? Oh, God. With a cricket's head, though. 0.66 speed. Yeah, buddy. BFF. Is that a BFF little lost fly? Hive minded lost fly. All right. There's some potential in that. Did I don't even I don't even know what's happening. I don't. What is this? What is this? Who are you? Excuse me. 
and suddenly everything was dead. Yeah, we're gonna reroll immediately if I can. Oh, there's a little battery over here. I need that. Hey, sausage! I say we D100 and we come back for sausage. Bomb the rune shard thing. Oh, Soul of Lilith probably doesn't get rerolled, right? Bum friend. Let's hope he gets rerolled. We have Godhead on this run too. It's a, such a shame that they paired it with Epic Fetus. Maybe we could win with Epic Fetus. I just think 0.66 speed. I don't have the ability to get away from enemies that are coming at me. And then I'm going to bomb everything, everyone, including myself. Nah. D100, go. What do we have? Epic Fetus still. Okay. Greg the Egg, though. Our buddy. Sausage, get over here. We have a uh, mapping, which is nice. Why can't I shoot right now? Is it Taurus? Am I Taurusing? I think I was Taurusing. I'm, oh, what the frick? I have no idea. I have no idea. I even have only eight broken hearts. For some reason there, I dropped a bunch of bombs. Maybe that was IBS. Oh, there it is. I can see it. But yeah, so uh, take away from the story. That was incredibly rigged.